spree. Major bookstores appear to be making a comeback. A new Barnes & Noble is set to open at the Shadow Lake Town Center in Papillion. Laura Sample is on your side with why this may be the beginning of a revival. For years, major bookstores seem to be vanishing from our national and local landscape. Years ago, there used to be a Barnes & Noble at 74th and Dodge right here near the Target at the old Crossroads site. And right across the street was a Borders bookstore, now the future site of Omaha's new Central Public Library. One of the only major bookstores still standing in the metro is the Barnes & Noble at Oakview Mall. But now Barnes & Noble is turning the page. The bookseller is opening a new location in Papillion Shadow Lake Town Center, taking over the former Best Buy store, which closed last year. It's so exciting. Janine Flanagan with Barnes & Noble says for a while, new bookstores were on the brink of extinction. We came to a screeching halt in terms of opening stores, so we hadn't opened stores in a very long period of time. Then the final days of the pandemic sparked a major plot twist. As places were opening, we found that communities used us um, as a gathering place to talk, to meet, to um, interact. And there really was a renewed interest in reading, um, whether it was people didn't have, you know, there was not much else to do, they, um, but there was an absolute renewed interest in reading over that period. And that meant a demand for more bookstores. Last year, we opened 31 stores, um, which was actually more stores than we had opened in the 10 years past combined. This year, we're looking to open somewhere between 50 and 60 new stores. It's a revival many readers in Papillion are happy to welcome. But I think it's fantastic. I think it'll be great to be able to buy books close to home um, instead of ordering them in a great place to maybe sip on coffee, sit and read. There's definitely not many of them and I feel like people don't really go to the library either so I think it's great that there's one opening. On your side in Papillion, Laura Sample, 6 News. The new Barnes & Noble is expected to open late this year or early next year.